Welcome to another episode of Soul Seekers. This time we are showing you that the mission of mentorship as conservation extends beyond the wild as Washington Backcountry hosts their annual community building event and fundraisers spread our mission, inspire others, and get connected face to face in the digital world. There is power in numbers and it is our job to ensure that our hunting heritage lasts for generations to come as you can never outgive good. Stay tuned and stay soulful. This is what we do, mentorship's conservation, and you can't outgive good. I'm Johnny Mack. Hunting has transformed my life unlike anything else. It has fulfilled my soul, provided purpose, brought adventure, and created a community of support. Follow along with me as I set off into the wild to ignite my soul while seeking to transform the lives of others. Welcome to Soul Seekers. Season two, Soul Seekers. Off to a heck of a start. Oh, we're here with Will Weber of Straight Sheet Fabrications, one of our mentees from Soul Seekers. And he's giving us a walkthrough of his building because we're about to host a killer event here. And I can't wait for this place to transform into just an amazing opportunity for everyone to talk hunting, conservation, mentorship. You can't outgive good. All right. I just pulled up to the shop. Today is the day the event is going down and I'm just pulling in. I got Will over here inside the shop already and he it looks like he's set up, so he's gonna be the first person we see. What up? What's going on, everybody? How's it going? Good, just putting the final touches on all this. Getting them sticker packages out there. Oh yeah, baby, you excited? Oh, so excited. Are, Are you, you nervous? Feeling? This is what to we do it for. Off, to show off your business or This what? is what we do it for. We're showing off what we do. That's right. What's going on? We're just here at the Washington Backcountry event. Uh, Johnny Max putting on a good event here for first responders, for families that lost their jobs in the pandemic and everything like that. Having a good time, drinking some beer, here for a good cause. As the crowd started to roll in and the energy escalated, it is always an exciting time to see what new faces you will get to meet and stories that will go with them. With this being a fundraiser for the first responders in the community, there was a lot of giveaways and prizes donated by some amazing companies that we couldn't wait to hand out. As different vendors worked on getting set up, we wanted to highlight them as a thank you for their support because many hands make for light work. And having the different businesses and organizations come to support the mission only supports there's more as you can never outgive good. I'm uh, Ross Sharp from the Crazy Oak Company. Out here to support our first responders. And uh, Johnny, doing a great thing for helping them. Try our best, give it a go, raise some money for these guys. Hey, I'm Dennis Stokes. I'm one of the owners of Initial Sand. And uh, we are so honored to be here at this event. Been looking forward to it for a long time. What I'm doing, I'm just setting up. We've got a pack on display. I'll have some packs to try on and everything. And, uh, we're from the Middleton, Idaho area. Yeah, we're here for Rocky Mountain Elk Foundation. And uh, trying to spread the word about habitat, access, and elk. Hey, I'm Rick Milu from Washington Waterfowl Association, Northwest Chapter. We're involved in conservation, youth hunts, and mentorship programs. Great to be here. Thanks for the invite. Hi, I'm Andy Kelso with the Washington Wild Sheep Foundation. Super excited to be here. Uh, it's been a long time since we got to uh, come back here. It's a couple years now. Uh, excited to talk to folks about wild sheep and uh, conservation in Washington State. My name is Rayleigh Proto and I'm the CEO of the Tally Outdoors and we are so excited to be here. It only takes a spark to start a fire, and that is why it is so important that we share our mission of mentorship as conservation throughout the community and through this show. As you lead with love and courage, you never know what souls you are going to impact on your journey. Just like throwing a stone into a pond, those ripples extend to all shores and your impact affects everyone around you. So we're here at the Washington Backcountry event. Uh, this is an awesome event here in Mokotio this year. Uh, we've got people coming in from all over the state. 
a bunch of conservation groups here, uh, learning, sharing their information with everyone, teaching people what they do and how they work. I mean, I'm one of those people that has always believed that mentorship is important, and the philosophy that mentorship is conservation really resonates with me, and so I enjoyed being here and meeting all of the people that, and all the vendors and seeing the community come together to support the lifestyle that we love and live. It was a beautiful thing and I was proud to be here. Give yourselves a round of applause for being here. I just want to say thank you so much to Dave and Will Weber right here, Iron Will, for opening up their business and hosting this event. We're going we're gonna to talk about Will's journey here because I had an opportunity and the pleasure of taking Will out on his very first hunt this last year. And he's going to talk about what it did to transform his life. Because here at Washington Backcountry, we talk about hunting has the power to transform lives through primal adventure. And what it starts with, it starts with courage. I was always taught that courage is the first known trait of mankind. From the decision to be courageous in your own life, you are allowing the opportunity for growth and transformation to take place. Once courage is established in one's soul, it is contagious and spreads just like a wildfire. And before long, souls are on fire all over this nation, as we become the change we want to see in the world. If you really care about hunting lasting for generations to come, then it's time to take a stand and get involved. Reach out to us if you have any questions or want to start an event in your own community, as you can never outgive good, and mentorship is conservation. Yeah. Astonishing what's going on with what your guys' platform is turning into. Congratulations. Yeah. Keep up the good work. Keep I'm proud of you. This is my first hunting season, and um, and so I really wanted to meet people and learn about the community that's growing here. This was really important to me because as a new hunter and someone who's just really entering this field, it feels awesome to meet all these people who are here and um, supporting one another. 